let's have a look at updating your AirPods software as there is no predefined option or button that you can press in order to make this happen. There's a couple of steps that you need to follow. Now, firstly, you can do this on an iPhone like I am here, but you can also do this on an iPad or a Mac. All you have to do is make sure that your Bluetooth is toggled on and then connect your AirPods to that device. So I'm going to go ahead and jump into my settings on my iPhone. All I have to do is open up the case on my AirPods. That will trigger the connection to be made, as you can see there. And then I get access to the AirPods settings menu where I can jump in here. And what I want to do is scroll all the way down to the about section, then click version number, and then you'll be able to compare your version number with the uh, website that's linked on this page. Uh, and you, all you'll need to do is find your AirPods and have a look what the latest version number is for those. Now, once I've uh, actually established I need an update, I'll go ahead and close my case. This will lose our ability to see the settings option here, but don't worry, the AirPods will still be connected as long as you keep the devices in range of each other. And you'll need to wait about 30 minutes for this process to happen. Once you've waited 30 minutes, again, open up your AirPods case. This will reconnect them onto your iPhone, again, with the same process that we saw last time. I can then jump into my settings, scroll down into the About section, click on Version, and make sure that that has updated and changed to the latest available version.